What's up guys, Sleepy here, and today we are going to be battling Chance from the Camden Ursa Rings as part of our P4G battles and whatnot. Uh, hopefully this works. You know, we had a ton of issues up to this point, but I'm thinking this time it's for real. Now, Garchomp, like in the team builder... I'm going to lead with Titar and hope that he leads with Garchomp like he did in the past week. And then, uh, go for that. We have to hope that he just doesn't expect us to be good. Really hoping he leads with the Garchomp. If he goes, we weren't really, like, expecting Snorlax at all. Um, but other than that, I think we're okay with this team very nervous this is a very nervous week i'm very nervous here we go chance about to get that ass beat all right so we're leading with tyranitar he leads with his gliscor So, we could probably go for an Ice Punch if this thing is max defense. Not entirely sure how he'll take it. I mean, I mean, it's four times, so... It really just comes down to his defenses. We have, I mean, we have Stone Edge, we have Crunch, we have Earthquake, but Ice Punch is probably the best bet. I don't know if he's going to protect right off the bat, if he's going to go for Toxic or something. I'm gonna say... I mean, we have, we have switchable options. Not quite, but quite a bit. Um, you know, we brought, I'm pretty sure we brought the defensive bolt, built buns. If he uses Earthquake, I'd probably get one-shotted. <clears throat> okay. So here's our- here's- here's what I'm thinking. We could go into Cresselia and take a hit, but the knockoff could do a lot. If he goes for a knockoff on me, it'll knock off, knock off, it'll knock off my scarf. But I could go for the ice punch. That did a nice amount of damage. He goes for a stealth rocks. That's a pain. He might protect. Okay, so he might go into Jellicent, he might go into Weezing, or he might protect, you know, uh, he, he won't, he won't be able to live another Ice Punch, even if he protects with the heal. I'm gonna okay, this is this is a weird play, but I think I'm gonna go. I think I I I think he I think he's gonna switch or use protect. I'm gonna go into convulsions here. I don't know, this could be a really risky play. This is this is pretty aggressive here. But we'll- we'll see where he goes from this. See if he switches or uses Protect. That's what I'm hoping. Yeah, okay, he does switch. He sent out the pipes, which is- okay, 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 okay. So... We got this guy. 
so what we can do now is... I think... We, we, we didn't... I don't think he can switch safely here unless he goes into Snorlax. And if he does go into Snorlax, we'd probably be better off going into Cobalion or Talonflame. Get the Tailwind off. Or we could go aggressive and hit Dark Pulse and just see what happens. I'm thinking, okay, so we got the boost. I'm gonna I'm gonna go for Dark Pulse. I was thinking about switching. I don't know if he might switch out or what, but I'm going I'm going for Dark Pulse. He didn't switch. He takes the Dark Pulse. Oh, he has Cursed Body. I didn't even think of that. Oh, but he flinched. He flinched. Okay, okay. Um, not not the worst thing at all. Um. I mean, he's pretty weak. I could... I don't know. I don't know if he's going to switch if he wants to just sack this thing off. I feel like a Psychic would kill if he does stay in. Uh, okay, okay. We could go into Talonflame. But I'm thinking I'm just going to go for the damage. Go a little offensive here. I'm not sure what his play is here. But I'm going to go for the Psychic damage and just hope that we can do some serious stuff here. Unless he wants to sack this thing, he's probably going to switch, yeah. It goes into Yokozuna. Okay, Snorlax. So Snorlax is going to take okay damage. We got the special defense drop. Okay, so I'm thinking that we can kill with Tri-Attack. Because of that special defense drop. If we can kill this Snorlax... If we can kill this Snorlax, I'm thinking... I'm thinking then we'd be pretty set on this team. I, I feel like, because we at, we're at plus one, he's at minus one. We have the upper hand there. Convulsion's obviously super powerful. I think we might be able to kill with Tri-Attack. I, I just really want to kind of get rid of the Snorlax, but he might switch. We might have an opportunity to switch here too. If we wanted to. I'm not sure how long Convulsions can really hold on here. I'm going to go for the Tri-Attack. I'm going for the Tri-Attack. I'm going to see if it kills. It kills! It kills! It kills! Oh my god, it kills. It really kills. That was awesome. Okay, S Snorlax is down. Snorlax is down. That's awesome because now we we didn't I didn't I mean we didn't plan for Snorlax at all. So that was a curveball here. That was that was kind of like a, an issue. So now with that out of the way, that's this is this is going pretty well. Gotta wait and see what he switches into here. We've got a good start so far.
He might go into Aerodactyl here. I feel like that might be his best play. He might want to try and get some damage off on us. Kind of try to... Alright, Purple Drank is Aerodactyl. Alright, so... I mean, we have options here. We have plenty of options, really. We're, we're definitely going to switch. I don't think Convulsions can really handle an Aerodactyl at all. Um, I'm thinking Cresselia. You know, we brought a bulky Cresselia. I don't... I don't know if he's running, like, a setup. There's options for home claws on Aerodactyl. But I'm thinking Cresselia. If he does go for a crunch, that's a pretty big move. But uh, I'm hoping he goes for a Stone Edge. Really hoping he goes for a Stone Edge. Alright, he's Mega Evolving, obviously. It's his Mega Aerodactyl. Wow, that thing is pretty ugly. Okay, let's see what he goes for. Rock Slide. So it's even less powerful. That's not going to hit for that much. It, it wasn't. It wasn't that much. A little more than I was expecting. I'm going to just go for the Reflect. I don't know what he's... I, don't, I, I hate when other people take a long time because I feel like they're planning something crazy, you know? Um, Cresselia would probably go down to half. A crunch is pretty threatening, but if we can get this reflect up... It's looking like he's... Gonna switch. I feel like when you take a long time, you're probably switching. But Reflect can help a lot. You know, we got eight turns of Reflect because we have the Light Clay. I feel like he's switching. I don't know. He's taking a really long time to decide. It makes me so nervous. I'm trying my best. I'm thinking maybe Defensive Cresselia scared him out. He might not even have Crunch. I don't know. Yeah, okay. Finally, he's switching. We get a free Reflect here. Can't go into Talonflame safely. He's probably just thinking of Scalding. Alright, well, we could attack, but I don't know if Cresselia would really be able to do that. We're probably better off switching. We could go into Torterra here. Who would be able to live a Scald or Ice Beam or whatever really he's got for us. So I'm, I'm thinking Torterra, I mean, we could go Porygon to scare him out, but I don't know how much a Scald would really do against Porygon. We don't want to lose him. So I, I think I'm going to go for Torterra here.
Let's see what he goes for here. Oh, he goes for Giga Drain. Alright, so that was good. So he's probably going to go for a switch. He could go for Ice Beam thinking maybe we won't be able to take it. He must know we're special defense. He might switch into Gliscor. I mean, I could go for like a Wood Hit. No. I mean, Stone Edge or Crunch seems like... We could go into Town Flame, get a Tailwind up. I'm thinking Town Flame. But I'm not entirely sure. I don't know what he's going to go for, but I'm, I'm thinking Talon Flame. Alright, he, he, he did go for the switch. This is good. This is really good. Because then we, we could have got... We could have got hit. He goes into wheezing. It's not the worst thing at all. I'm going to go for Tailwind. I don't know what his plan is. Um, yeah, he's going for Toxic Spikes. That's not bad. Now I'm thinking Porygon. Okay. Um, I'm going to go into Porygon. He's not going to mind the Toxic Spikes too much. I think he's just going to go for another round at Toxic Spikes. Which isn't the worst thing. Alright, we got that special attack boost. Yeah, he's going for the second set of Toxic Spikes. Alright, so... I'm just going to go for Psychic. I don't I don't know. Uh, I mean, Psychic would kill. Convulsions is pretty weak. No matter what, we're going to die. But we'll get good damage and we'll be able to go into uh, Tyranitar. Alright, he's going to sack off Jellicent here. Which, you know, is fine by me. We got the crit. I don't know if the crit mattered, but... Yeah, okay, we're going down because of the life orb poison. But that's fine, you know? That's 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 fine. That's not bad at all. He, he really did plenty, 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 plenty. He did plenty, you know? So now I'm going to go into Tyranitar...
Whatever he goes into will take hell damage. I was just thinking go straight into T-Tar. Because we have the Tailwind up. Which means our speed is crazy. Weezing might be his best play if he sends him in. We gotta see what he goes into here. Taking a while. This guy likes his thinking time. Alright, he goes into Aerodactyl. We got Sandstream back up. We can go for the Stone Edge. I'm going to go for the Stone Edge. The only thing this wouldn't really damage is Garchomp. So we just got to, you know, and Weezing, but... I think this might be just the safest play for now. I mean, we have the Tailwind up. We might as well just roll with it. See what he goes for here. Would be great if we got rid of Aerodactyl. That basically means we don't need Tailwind anymore. But he's probably switching. I'm thinking he's going to switch because he's taking a while. Really taking his time here. Really stalling out this battle. Alright, here we go. Oh, he didn't sw <laughs> Which, but he avoided! Oh, and he used EQ. Okay. That sucks that we missed. That really sucks. The Reflect saved our life. I mean, Tailwind's out. So, we're kind of we're kind of screwed. We don't outspeed. He's going to kill with EQ. That sucks. That really sucks that we just missed that. Okay. Oh boy. That, that was that was a whole bunch of that was a whole bunch of malarkey. That was the most important Stone Edge. So let's look at our options here. Um, Our only real option would be Cresselia, so I guess I'm just going to switch into Cresselia. Oh, he switched out. He goes into Jurgens, Garchomp. Okay, we go into Cresselia. Should be able to take an Outrage or whatever he wants to do here. Our reflect wore off. We could go straight for Ice Beam here, or we could hit Reflect. Um, I think I'm going to go for Ice Beam. 
if he D dances, I'm gonna I'm gonna I'm gonna lose it. Oh boy. Okay. I mean, we just we just really have to get lucky with these plays. That 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 stone miss. That was That was rough. That was rough. All we can do from here on out is just try to outplay. Oh, that sucks so bad that we missed that. Okay. Okay. Okay, I'm over it. I'm over it. It's all in the past. We're moving on. We got the future ahead of us. Got our whole lives ahead of us. We can do this. We got this. This is this is this is fine. This is fine. You know? Just gotta wait and see what he goes for. Okay, so he switched out. Kind of saw that coming after such a time. He goes into this thing. I went for the ice beam. Safe play. It did some damage. We gotta, we gotta go for the reflect to keep the damage off. We really can't sack this. We should probably switch after the reflect. This is getting rough. This battle's getting rough, you know? We got this. We got this. This is so intense. Okay, okay. It's intense, but we got it. It's intense, but we got it. Come on, let's see what you got. Let's see what you got. I don't know if he's gonna switch. I feel like every time he takes a long time, it's probably him switching. I don't really know why. I'm still salty about the stone miss. I really am. The stone edge, ugh. Right back into this thing. The reflect will help. But, okay, so, I'm thinking Cobalion. He's not going to Earthquake. We have Levitate. This might be the play. Okay, switch into Cobalion. He's not going to EQ. And we would survive an EQ. We can survive any other, all the other moves he has. We resist. Yeah, okay. We got Rock Slide. We, we should tank. Yeah, we tank that so much. Okay. Wow, nothing. Nothing. All right, we're back. We we have to magnet rise here. This is probably our best option. Um, don't think I outspeed, but we will be able to survive an earthquake. So we just we just have to hope. We just have to hope and go for it. You know. All right, he goes for the EQ. We're going to live that. We eat that. We eat that. Nothing at all. That did nothing. Magnet rise. We're floating, boys. We're at high health. We can safely iron head.
We can two hit KO this. He's probably going to switch into Weezing. Yeah, okay, the Weezing. Not enough to two hit KO on that. He tanked it a lot. He ta Wow, okay. He really tanked that. So here... I'm thinking... I, I don't know. I don't know. He could he could have flamethrower. He could go for Will O Wisp. I don't know if I want to switch. He, he can he can really screw us with this thing. This thing's a pain in my butt. He can't he can't burn the Tyranitar, but. He could just stall the poison out. I, I feel like our only real option here would be Talon Flame. Hope he uses Will O Wisp. Hope we don't die to rocks. I think, I think, oh. Okay, communication error, guys. That's, that's annoying, that's annoying, that's real, uh, okay. I'll be back, guys. What's up, guys? Sleepy here, again. And, uh, unfortunately, he did, Chance did DC. Uh, and we we're looking at a bad spot there. So we're actually going to go right into this battle with dropped off our KO'd Mons and uh, do what we can with full HP on the rest, which kind of makes me feel like we're in a better situation. Um, so I'm just going to, I'm just going to, you know, ask him what should we lead with anything or... I think we had Cresselia on the field, but I don't know. If we lead with Cresselia, we could just set up Reflect. And that's what we already had out on the field when the DC hit. Um, so... I'm thinking, I, I'm thinking I'm just gonna lead with Cresselia. Okay, so yeah, I'm going to lead with Cresselia. He, uh, I talked to him about it. He said we should lead with what we had. So, uh... So, you know, he had Weezing out. I had Cresselia out. I mean, it's kind of rough that we brought Psy Shock instead of Psychic. But ultimately, I think we'll be fine. I mean, we could have, you know, psychic the Weezing. I'm going to go for the Reflect first. He can do whatever he wants. He can, he can set up. He can... He can Toxic Spike. He can Will-O-Wisp. We'll just get the reflect up. He can't recover, so we can just psychic or psy shock it until it dies. Oh, 
We'll see what he goes for here. He's probably switching, I'm thinking, just because he's uh, taking his time here. So let's just wait around, see what he goes for. Reflect should do what we want it to. Very intense first half of the battle, I must say. This is like a it was like an intermission, now we're back, you know? It's okay, that was like the that was like the cutscene. He's he's uh thinking pretty hard, I guess, about what he wants to do here. Okay, yeah, he does switch into Jurgens, his guard chomp. He's probably gonna want a dragon dance. I think I'm just gonna go for ice beam just in case he wants to go for the dragon dance. He might be trying to get that easy sweep. I'm gonna try to limit him a little bit here. He might expect us to switch. I'm not I'm not entirely sure, but it really depends on what he what what kind of guard chomp this is, you know? I think an Ice Beam should at least two hit KO. And, uh, I don't, I don't know. Like, if he does go for the Dragon Dance, we might probably live a boosted attack. Really depends on how he sets up here. I, I don't want to get swept like he got swept week one. I'm not gonna let this happen. We gotta, we gotta really think here. He's, he's taking a long time. I don't know if he's switching again or what, but a lot of thinking to do in this game, you know. A lot of thinking. So let's wait and see. Dee -dee 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 -dee. Camden Ursa Rings, I must say, their logo looks pretty good. Alright, so he switched, again. Absolute madman. Goes into Aerodactyl. Now, Aerodactyl's about to get hit by this Ice Beam. Ice Beam does a solid amount. So we could probably just keep going for Ice Beam. I don't know, because, he, you know, he's going to Mega... I don't know what he can even do to us. Oh, he's going for Roost. I guess he's going to try to stall us? Huh. I don't know. Let's see. Let's see what he's got, yeah? Go for the rock slide. We eat that. Ooh, but we got the flinch. I don't know. I feel like we can just keep on ice beaming. I don't know if he's trying to stall. I don't know what he's trying to do. But we can play these games. We can definitely play these games. I got all day, all night to play these goddamn games. Cresselia has got like weird hands. Are those hands or like feathers or like boobs? bra thing? It's not a bra. It's definitely not a bra. It's like a necklace. It's so weird. It must be hands. It looks like hands. Alright, so let's see what he's got. He's thinking hard. He's thinking hard. I don't know what about, but he's thinking hard. Okay, he goes for another rock slide. All right, so we got that super effective rock slide. I'm just gonna keep going for ice beam. He's probably gonna wanna roost here.
I don't... I'm thinking... I think he's gonna try to stall our Ice Beam PP. So, I mean... Might be able to switch out into something else instead. If we predict the Roost, we can get a Tailwind off. Like, if he goes into Roost now, we can Tailwind, switch it back, and then just Ice Beam him to death. Yeah, okay, he goes for the Roost. So we get a Tailwind. Which is totally fine. No Stealth Rocks damage. We're gonna go for the Tailwind. Let's see what he does. He goes for Rock Slide. That will probably kill. Yeah, okay. But it's fine because we have a free switch now into whatever we want. So, at this juncture, we still have the Reflect up. I think we... can go into Mike Tyson... And probably go for Stone Edge. Now, obviously, we we don't want to get that miss again. If we need to switch, we can switch. But I'm thinking we go for Stone Edge. We still got a... Uh... Or we could go for Ice Punch. He still has Gliscor. He still has Garchomp. But I think he goes into Weezing. So we should probably go for Stone Edge. But... I think I'm gonna go for Ice Punch, because we still have our... Reflect up. I don't know if he's gonna switch. No, he switched, he switched. Probably Weezing. Yeah, he goes into Weezing. We can just go right back into Cresselia and just... Play the game again. I mean, that did nothing, obviously, but... Now, our Reflect is up now. That's fine. We go right back into Cresselia. We can get another... Reflect up, and then we can just do this again. There's gonna be Stall Wars, too. He goes for Will-O-Wisp. So now I guess we could just go straight for a Psy Shock if we wanted to. Because he's not going to, if we really need to, we can get a Reflect up at a later time. And we'll do a solid amount of damage if he does decide to stay in. He can, There's no way he can stall us out if he stays us in. Stays in. There's a whole lot of stally things going on right here. If he switches, I don't really mind. Yeah, he goes right in the back into Aerodactyl. Psyshock did a decent amount of damage. Our Tailwind is out. I'm thinking here we can finally make some kind of use out of Torterra. His big debut, here we go. We should be able to eat up any attack he goes for, unless he has Ice Fang, which I'm doubting. And just... 
go for Stone Edge? Just go for Stone Edge and I guess hope we don't miss again. I don't know why he would have Ice Fang unless he was super predictive of this, but I, I feel like he doesn't. He doesn't have Crunch, so... Ice Fang would be really good prep on his part. If he had Crunch, he would have used it by now, so that... I don't know what... I don't know what he's packing. It might be Ice Fang. Kinda nervous. It really depends on what happens here, but I think we have this. I think he's switching. If he takes this long, he's usually switching. I don't know what he would switch into. Maybe... Let's see. Okay. That, that did nothing at all. That was... That was rough. Okay, so... We have to make... This is vital. We have to make some kind of right play. Can't stay in and just let him stall us out. Um, I'm thinking, okay. Let me, th let me ponder for a moment. We could go into Kobe. And force out the wheezing. I think I'm going to go into Cobalion. Because if he goes for knockoff... He goes for Stealth Rock. That, that's... That's going to hurt Cresselia, but, but we should be okay. Um... I think I'm gonna go for a Magnet Rise and just kinda scout him out a little bit. See what he wants to go for here. I don't- I don't wanna risk anything crazy on Cresselia. Cresselia may be one of our most needed right now. If he goes for EQ, it shouldn't do that much. If he goes for a knockoff, we get that attack boost. I don't know if he'd actually do that, but... We know this thing has Roost and Stealth Rock. Probably also has Stone Edge, Earthquake. It could have... I mean, I think it has Spikes. No, it sets up Stealth Rock. Just kidding. I think he's switching. Yeah, okay, so he goes into Weezing. We got the Magnet Rise. So what we can do here is actually just... Go for the Thunder Wave. And then maybe try to hax it out? I don't really know. Just try to flinch it to death or something. Yeah, okay, he goes for Willow. We 
We can't really send in Cresselia on this. So... I'm thinking just go for Iron Head because we don't we don't have any options really. Just try our best to do what we can. Maybe we can whittle it down enough. For like one of our others, like Tyranitar or Torterra. Our, our best bet right now is just to keep going for Iron Head. Hope he gets some flinches. Oh, but he set up Toxic Spikes. It doesn't really matter at this point, I feel like. We're already kind of screwed all over the place. <laughs> we just have to whittle him down. I don't know if he's getting it all back or not with Black Sludge. We're doing so little I can't even tell. Okay, he went for Flamethrower. He's probably just gonna sack off Kobe here. And then hope we have done enough damage in the end to make a difference. We just have to- we just have to keep going. Oh, we got the flinch. We got the flinch, there we go. That means we get at least another iron head. Alright, he went for Flamethrower. Probably gonna kill here. Yeah, okay, we're down. Alright, so we didn't really get much there. Okay, so I'm thinking... Oh boy, okay. I'm thinking... At this point in time... We go into Cresselia. And we reflect. That's probably our best- our best thing to do. Would be just go for the Reflect and try to let Tyranitar at least take some hits. Okay, he's going for the Switch. We scared him out, effectively. So, Cresselia didn't die, but flinched, which sucks. We went for the Ice Beam there. Would have been nice if we got the Ice Beam. Uh, we probably could have killed with Ice Punch if we got that Ice Beam off, but whatever, I guess. Um, so, I guess we... Okay, so I'm gonna go for Stone Edge. Pray so hard that this hits. And then if it misses or if he switches, we just have to switch to Torterra and just try our best. Oh god. This is messy. This is messy. Yeah, okay, he's switching. 
He goes into Gliscor. Took a decent amount of damage. Um, okay, so... I'm gonna, I, I, I gotta go into Torterra. We, ha we would have to get the Ice Punch on the Switch in or something. We just can't stay in. EQ would kill. Let's see what he goes for here. Okay, now we're toxic all around. Yeah, he goes for the EQ. We eat that easy. The reflect is gone if we just keep on wearing it out, you know. I I guess our best bet would be Stone Edge. Hope we get a crit or some crazy shit. I don't I don't really know. We gotta we gotta look we gotta we gotta pray hard for the crit. Pray hard for the crit. Everyone everyone put your hands together. Pray to Arceus, we get this crit. Okay, he stayed in, went with EQ. Maybe he thought we were gonna switch. That that's that's all we can do. This is looking bad. This is looking real bad. Ugh, okay. We we have I I, I. I, I think we have to go into T-Tar and try and hope for the best with Ice Punch. Yeah, okay, we're gonna we're gonna take a lot of damage from this EQ. Okay, we, we, we just we just have to hope for some miracles. We we need some miracles here. Give me the miracles. Give me the miracles. Oh, didn't even die. Oh, he's going for EQ. Oh, no, we're dead. We're dead. Okay, so that's no good. This is no good. I'm not even sure where I went wrong. I'm just... I just... This, this sucks. <laughs> this sucks. Oh, God. Okay. So, I guess we can... Uh, go for Stone Edge. Oh boy. Let's go for Woodhammer. He's gonna roost, okay, and now we're gonna go for Woodhammer. Let's see if we even do half. Going for the plays. Get that crit or something, come on. Oh okay. It did it did okay. I uh, 
Uh, I didn't really have anything to deal with the wheezing. I mean, Chrysalia... But Porygon was really our best bet, and he went too early. And the roost on the Aerodactyl. That was... The best thing I can hope for right now is to get a kill with Woodhammer and not get 4-0'd. He's switching. Alright, he's not letting us get th he's not he's not letting us get 3 0 He's not about it. Oh boy. I guess we stone edge here. Uh, and then we're dead. Go for the stone edge. I don't know, hope for like some kind of super crit. No, we got nothing. Damn. That sucks. Alright. The the stone miss. It's all the stone miss. I swear to god. If we had killed the Aerodactyl earlier, if we killed it during that stone edge, we would have been fine. We would have been fine. Even if the DC happened, we would have came back 5v3 and we would have been fine. And that was, that was just rough. Oh boy. Okay, so that's one battle we lost, but we're gonna win the rest. So, uh, good game to chance. Check out his channel and stuff, his battle from his point of view, whatever. I love you all, you're all great people, and uh, I guess I will see y'all another day. That's, this, uh, that's rough, that's rough. Oh boy.